Okay, so here's the next video, and I'm on the other side of the camera today, so you can write. Um, so let's see if I can write through the tripod here. So uh, Raf actually said, hey, look, take a look at this <laughs> one, one root two triangle, and then we'll mirror image it over here so that we actually have an inscribed circle. Okay. And um, we're trying to find this radius r. Yes. So this is actually nice. I'm actually just this was his idea. How would you approach the problem from here? Um, well, the there's a formula for the area of a triangle that says um, the area a equals the semiperimeter of the triangle s times r. I guess it would be big R in this case. Um, where S the semi perimeter and R is the radius of the inscribed circle. Okay. Um, well, we know the area in this case because we know that this base is 2 and the height is 1, so then we know the area is 1. Uh, so then we know that 1 equals, this is 1, this is root 2, 2 plus root 2 times this radius. Where did that 2 plus root 2 come from? Right, 2 plus 2 root 2 actually because, or no, 1 plus root 2 because you have the semi Okay. Okay. 1 plus root 2 times r. Um, okay, so then I guess we can divide by 1 plus root 2, so we get 1 over 1 plus root 2 equals r. Um, you could leave it like this, but we can rationalize the denominator by multiplying by 1 minus root 2 over 1 minus root 2. Um, and we get 1 minus root 2 divided by 1 minus 2. So this would become minus 1. And then multiplying by minus 1 over minus 1 give us um, uh, root 2 minus 1. Very good. Okay, great. Um, <clears throat> really well done. And now, um, for the third video, I'm going to challenge you to see if you can uh, tell me how you prove this formula.